All right, so this was Saturday's tour. Lawn got cut again. Oh yes, and I got rid of the anthill. Tractor took care of it, guys. Just tore it right up. But anyhow, so we got this up for little man, which is uh, April's little boy. So we got it up for him. And this, believe it or not, guys, I've had this since April was little. And well, it just came off the end because the wind blew it off. But I think it's because um, this is up too high. These here, there's not enough distance between it. On that other one over there, I think I got it too high. I wouldn't put it on. But I'll just, April's gonna put it back on, so. But I guess little man was on this morning. He really likes it. And believe it or not, guys, this thing is like, I've had a long time. Since the Sheeran's kids were little. And they're in their, what are they in? They're in their 20s now. So, um, yeah, can't believe it. How well and how good in shape they are. So, and then the anthill, I'll show you the anthill, I took care of it. Uh, a little bit of grass now, I'll have to cut around it. Because I couldn't do it before. <laughs> but there it is. There's a few ants left in it. But the majority of it, because I pulled it back over that way. And then I shoved it up in there. So if they want to continue with their colony, they can go ahead up in there. So, I just got rid of it off the lawn because I'm going to... You know, you can see them. There's still some ants in there yet. They're looking for the colony, probably. But, uh, yeah, ain't not much left to it. Because it was, well, you saw it. It was, like, probably, what, two feet high almost? But, uh, yeah, this is coming along. Still got these here sticking up, and i got to cut off some more of these again. But it's coming along. It's like everything. And I got the lawn cut. That was yesterday. Today was a productive day over on the other side. So I'm going to show you. The goats are always howling because... April just gave him some grass. I'll take these guys down. I'll show you these guys. Well, I got a little bit of copper cleaned, as you can see. So I got all that done. So that's uh, number two. I got a bucket of brass started again over there. And these are all the goodies that was down there in the long grass. So I just brought it up here because it's shaded here and I can go through it and clean it. Off the back of my truck, I had to clean this. It's an air conditioner. I got that one to clean. And then odds and ends. So we're going to go through it and see what's here. And I'll throw it in the, the bins bins I got here sitting here for this stuff and then that's not all I got done so I'm going to show you what I got done in the bottom yard whoo I've been busy 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 all right so there isn't much left here not even a full dump truck or dump trailer load yet left here guys even I've got the uh, swing that I flattened out most of it there was a shelf here I flattened it uh, there's like a bed spring in there it's got to go there's another one over there that's going to go those chairs are steel the bikes are steel a little bit of steel here a box of copper which has got to go up there and that barbecue end um and the door's got to go because it's steel and then that drum and there's a few other eyes and ends in there but it's not even a full load i'm going to show you the trailer i already got it i've got it pretty much full i still got the cooler to go but it'll go this week i'll get it moved so i think i did pretty good today but I'm going to clean all this and then drag this all up in a pile. And then I'm going to put all whatever loose, all this loose grass and stuff like this all in the bucket. And I'm going to take it up and dump it in the decomposed, lid. like, you know, this is dirt and dirt. It's all it's going to be when I'm done because I'm going to clean all this up. So, but uh, I'll scrape all this in here. So it'll all be parking in here. A pile of scaffolding over there is going to go in the scrap pile too. So I got uh, another sign, aluminum sign. I don't know if you can see it. It's past the stump. The stump's going to get pushed too. So... That there, I'll take that out of there. And then I gotta clean up over there. Some aluminum sticking up out of there. And then I'm gonna push that, clear that up in there too. So, I'm gonna get it cleared up. Oh yeah, the brother-in-law, he came in and graded the road because I guess it needed it again. So there's the, there's the trailer. And like I said, I still got this to go, so. But I gotta get the, uh, the other rad out of it. There's a rad in there yet, and some copper. That's why it hasn't gone yet. So it's it's on my list. This week, his going for sure. Well, tomorrow it won't because uh, I got this load going out tomorrow. And then Tuesday, I got another big load to pick up with the other trailer. So, yeah. So, probably, maybe I'll move it. Maybe I'll be able to move it up on the top of the hill for now because I'm just trying to clean up. I mean, essentially anything now I bring in is going up top. I'm not going to be dumping it down here because I'm going to clean this up and scrape it. And make sure there's no, you know, run it over with my magnet thing and make sure there's no uh, screws or nails down here too. Scrape up all the dirt and stuff too. So, but uh, it's looking better. I've uh, spent, well, off and on because it's been raining off and on all day. So, I just got to hook the trailer on for tomorrow. So, we've been just carrying it across and throwing it in. Some of it I dumped in with the bucket. Um, I picked a lot of the, the goodies up out of here. There's still some here that's got to be picked up yet. 
but uh, I gotta get the, there's a chunk of brass on that that's gotta come off yet that's why it's still sitting there and then those there are fence posts so and there's some more crap and steel up in there that we're gonna get rid of too so whatever's up in there for steel it's gonna go I'm gonna clean it up guys and make some room make some more money and you know what I mean? Like I said, I still like to make another big purchase. So the trampoline was not a big purchase, guys. I didn't purchase the trampoline. I had it stored away. So it didn't cost me a dime. It was a freebie because I already bought it many, many years ago when the kids were little. Another chunk of shit wire, which is worth $1.35 a pound, guys. So, yeah, but I got to get in here yet. I don't know what's called in here still. So I'll get in that grass there. I had pants on today, so. And like I said, there's the shelf. But uh, it's coming along. It's looking a lot better. I know there are one more weekend I should have, or not like one more day. Two hours tops, maybe three. It depends on how much stuff is actually in there. And I'll get picked through it and throw it in piles. So, bring the trailer, leave the trailer where I can get at it. Maybe I'll back the trailer along the edge here. Make room right here, right along here. Put the trailer in here, and then anything that's steel right in it. So, that's what I might do. And that'll be the last load down here. I'm pretty sure I can get all this in it. With any problems but anyway guys that's my weekend that's my update it was a decent half like it rained today quite off and on um yesterday we didn't get any rain but it was windy like this yesterday but gorgeous we took trampoline up i got the lawn cut and uh yeah i'm sure the lawn will be cut again after raining again today so but anyhow guys thanks for watching and i'll catch you on the next one